Hey guys, welcome to Rain King Recording. Thank you for checking this out today. Um, what we got here is two Purple Audio MC77 limiting amplifiers. And I'm just going to kind of go through them today and show you the different parts they had and talk a little bit about the sound that you get out of them. Now, obviously, if you have used Pro Tools or are familiar with the studio, uh, you know this looks a lot like a Universal Audio 1176 or a, or a Yuri 1176. Um, and it's basically the same thing. I've never put them next to each other. There's a lot of um, uh, people talking back and forth online about, you know, what the difference is. And kind of what I'm getting is that these sound a little bit closer to the original 1176s, maybe the ones by Yuri. And the Universal Audio ones sound a little bit different. Maybe not as good. I don't know. I've never put them up next to each other. I know they get the similar type of sound. Uh, kind of a shimmy, um, really nice, fet, um, uh compression um they sound great on percussion great on vocals um i've used them on bass so i'm kind of going to go through all this and it's essentially the same uh if you're if you've got an 1176 so over here obviously first you have your input clearly that's your input next you have your output on these compressors there's no threshold it's just set so as you put as more input comes in you're going to get more gain reduction and you're going to need to compensate with the output um, really simple um, you've got your attack your release on the purple audio you have an insert switch so you could insert an EQ if you ever wanted to and you've also got a link switch so I can link these two together and make them stereo via a sidechain um, starting from the top in your ratio section um, it, you have 20 dB I'm sorry uh, 20 to 1 ratio 12 to 1 8 to 1 4 to 1 um, Basically, I, I for vocals I'll typically use it on eight to one, and you know, for bass I switch it between the two because I might drive bass a little bit harder, and uh, get a little more compression just by giving a little more input. Um, but uh, one of the tricks with these, and this is the same with the eleven seventy six, and even the plug-in, uh, the Bomb Factor version for the MC seventy seven and the eleven seventy six, if you push all of these in, you're getting a forty to one ratio. Um, now, when you push them all in, this pretty much becomes completely unreliable. We just have to use your ear. But it's a cool little trick, and I don't know if they, if uh, originally Yuri designed them to do that, but they do do that. And if you're doing this in Pro Tools, you can push Option and click on any one of these, and you will be able to make it a 4 to 1 ratio. Um, then over on the end here, we've got our gain reduction and in and out switch, and right now it's in. So it's in. You have a bypass switch, and you can turn it on and off there. So obviously it just turned off. Now it's back on. Cool. And I'll put it back to 8 to 1. That's where I usually leave it. And make sure that's out. Cool. So that's the Purple Audio um, MC77. Very similar to the 1176. Uh, and there's a lot of other, you know, people that try to mimic these. So... Uh, one of these days I'm going to do a comparison between the two um, and just put them right next to each other. Brand new Purple Audio, brand new uh, UA 1176. So guys, stay tuned for that. And if you've got any questions, please leave them in the comment section and I'll be happy to answer them. Thanks a lot. Bye.